Act three, scene three, opens with Desdemona assuring Cassio she'll help him get his rank back. When Cassio sees Othello and Iago approaching, he leaves in a hurry. In response, Iago makes one of his signature remarks, ha, I like not that. When Othello asks, what dost thou say? Iago responds, nothing, my lord, or if, I know not what. By encouraging Othello to think he knows something he's keeping hidden, he opens a space in which doubt, then jealousy, can grow. This is emphasized in Iago's next reply to Othello's, was not that Cassio parted from my wife? He says, Cassio, my lord? No, sure, I cannot think it, that he would steal away, so guilty-like, seeing your coming. When Othello asks Desdemona what she's been doing, she tells him she's been talking to a suitor, which could mean a man who has a romantic interest, but in this case means someone who needs something from her. Desdemona then asks Othello when he'll consider listening to Cassio's suit. Othello says, not now. When she exits, Iago piles on the inferences that, for example, she did deceive her father marrying you, and when she seemed to shake and fear your looks, she loved them most. When Desdemona re-enters the scene to inform him that his dinner guests await, he tells her he has a headache. Mm. She offers her handkerchief, he mm. rejects it, and it falls to the ground. Amelia picks it up, then Iago demands it. It's the perfect object to plant in Cassio's quarters. Othello's increasing jealousy is exacerbated by Iago's claim that he's heard Cassio talk in his sleep about having sex with Desdemona. He claims he's seen Cassio with the handkerchief. Othello swears he'll kill Desdemona. Iago promises to kill Cassio. This long scene demonstrates Iago's method of leading Othello to think the worst possible thoughts about his wife. He does this by suggesting possibilities, by indirection, and by innuendo. It also provides the material, the handkerchief, for the ocular proof Othello demands at the scene's end. For anyone studying this play, it's crucial to pay close attention to the method Iago deploys to ensnare Othello. It begins with his language early in the scene at line 35 quoted above, nothing my lord, or if I know not what. The inference is that Iago knows something that he'd rather not say, 